start off, here are some adjectives that I associate with Rachmaninoff's music. A crucial ingredient is the common arpeggio. Let's take that to a lower register. And we're going to make it slightly more complex by adding some more harmonic information. Now let's get familiar with this galloping dotted rhythm. Sometimes the accent will be on the front end of the grouping. Now let's add chromatic neighbor tones to each of these chords. For a harmonic progression, let's choose one that has a common tone in the bass. The more augmented chords, the better. Let's take chords in triplets. And the more massive the chords, the better. Now let's take the chromatic scale. and nudge them between arpeggios and other passages. Have multiple layers of sound and bring out inner lines at key moments. interact with each other as in dialogue. Open up the music to grandiose, expressive, and soaring melodies. Here's a passage grouped evenly together. Now let's make it two against three. And now six against seven. Here's a cadence with a secondary dominant chord. Voice it in a way that's richer and more open. Make use of a wider register of the keyboard. Keep in mind that many of the chords are colored with extensions with exception to the resolving chord. In this way, we're oftentimes only a few notes away from a jazzier sound. Include sparkling passages in the upper register. Create drama by building up momentum and energy. And the more iterations of the ending, the better. And now here's Happy Birthday in the style of Sergei Rachmaninoff.